Hey guys, Lex here, back for some more Nino Kuni. Last time we defeated Chidar, and now we gotta celebrate. All right, that's not. I didn't actually play any off screen since then. Let me see if there's any quests. Oh, wow. Now I evolve you. Oh, wait, it's this one. Uh... Doesn't say what he needs. Let me swap out you. Oops. Switch. Yeah. Well. Grab one of these. Nothing new here. I don't want to get walking heels. That doesn't really matter to me anymore. This is useful. Instead of wasting time restoring MP all the time during battle. Uh, I don't think this works in battle, so might as well do jack full trades, then jack the giant killer, and then the HP one later. Alright, let's go straight to the place. So I didn't see anything on the way here, so we're just going straight to the palace. Oh. It's been a long time here, Meow Justy. Yo, hello, one here's congratulations are in order. You defeated the, you know, whom. yeah, old habits, you defeated Shadar, did you not? One always knew that you would, of course. One had absolute faith from the first. Well, we couldn't have done it without you, Yar, Meow Justy. We couldn't even have gotten near him without that clarion. Yeah, one's little creation came in handy, did it? How very gratifying. That's right. If the heads of the three kingdoms hadn't worked together, we would never have made it. Hmm, young Oliver, hero, how time flies. You seem like such an ordinary boy. But you followed one's orders to the letter and bravely set out to defeat the Dark Jin. You know, it seems like only yesterday. Wow, that ain't how it is. I mean, do you think you might have misremembered things in all your majesty? <laughs> Why, of course not, but enough about oneself. Wander from another world, you and your companions have done well. You have saved our world. What will you claim as your ward? Good point. Sure we could think of something. Any ideas, Oliver? Uh, I want to go home to Motorville. Meh, yeah, surely not. Made up your mind, haven't you, Oliver? I suppose it's your home, after all. Well, yeah, but Alicia, I mean, your mom, she ain't... Okay, maybe I can save my mom. Meeting all of you and coming to your world and going on this adventure? It made me stronger. You could say that again. <laughs> now, I'm kind of lost. Traveling with all of you has been so much fun. And I've learned that there's nothing we can do if we're to work together. But I started out on this journey because I thought I could save my mom. And now that's over. Oliver! Oh, I have to go back to Motorville. It's where me and mom live together. Miss Leela's there, and Phil, and Myrtle too. Sorry, everyone. I should have spoken to you all about this. All right, Oliver. It's your life. It's your decision. It's right. You've really... You've really grown up, Oliver. Of course he has. He has... He's had expert guidance. Ta, ah, very much, I must say. Not been easy at times, but... Stop it, both of you. What a pair of big heads. Ha 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 ha. So, does this mean all this 
four of us talking together, laughing together, it's all over. Oh, you'll come back to see us, won't you, Oliver? Of course you will. This is your home from home now, ain't it, Dolly Boy? Of course it is. Thanks, everybody. <laughs> One has just had a marvelous idea. Would you care to hear it? Thank you, see, for having a moment here, man. Fine, go on, what was it? We're having a grand celebration, are we not? Why don't we make young Oliver's departure a part of the festivities? Ah, oh, I couldn't. I think it's a wonderful idea. Please, Oliver, you say you'll do it. Gee, uh, I guess I, uh, sure. Thank you, your mere justy. Perfect. There it is decided. You will have a hero send-off. Hey. Uh, is this... Really? Send off? Am I gonna beat the game down? <laughs> uh. I mean, no, because there's gonna be a whole bunch of. Maybe there's post game side quests, because I don't have enough points from the, the stamp collection. So, yeah, let's just do it. But the, oh, the hip bubbles on the head. You've performed enough heroic deeds for one lifetime, Oliver. One takes it, you will now be returning to your own world. Leave everyone behind and return home to Motorville. I saved before this. <laughs> Very well, thing and a magnificent farewell feast will be prepared. So farewell. Yes, thanks for everything, your majesty. <laughs> so it's the end of our double act, is it? You made one heck of a sidekick, Ollie boy. When you get home, you look out for Myrtle, won't you? Hey, come back and visit you here. We'll go somewhere dangerous, for old time's sake. You got it. Thank you, everybody. Be good, Oliver. Uh, but not too good. See you next time our world's in a potch. Take care, all of you. Thank you. Farewell, Oliver. Bye. An end to Bye. pain. Uh -huh. What's that? I knew it. What did you do, Ollie boy? Nothing, I promise. Pitiful fools. My gift of mana will cleanse your tainted souls. This stuff. What? What is it? Snow? But it isn't cold. Oh, I should probably talk to him. <gasps> Oh shit. <laughs> Forgot to talk to old. What the hell? Fish people? What is this? What the heck? Your Majesty! Oh, what the? Marcusan! You must come with me! Oh, far away! Oh, shit. Oliver! Oliver! Who's there? It's me, P. Oliver. It's falling. The ash is falling again. I have to go back there. Huh, P? What do you mean, the ash is falling? Wait, I get it. You mean the banana, huh? That stuff from before, right, P? Are you here now, in this world? Are you here in Ding Dong Dell? P, wait! P, wait for me! P! Don't scare me like that. What are you shouting? Where am I? We're flying? Wait, is this? It is, boy. You're back aboard the most formidable ship ever to sail the skies. The Iron Wyvern. Hell yeah! The Iron Wyvern. <laughs> Oliver! You're awake? It's Moccasin. What are you doing here? Quite a tale. Let me tell you all that has been happening. I never know how to voice him. 
Oh, it wasn't all a dream. Sadly not. The mountain banana man has changed them. Changed everything. That's right, Mon. And if it hadn't been for the prince here, we'd have been changed into horrible beasties ourselves. Proper clothes was. What? So everybody even... Everybody in Ding Dong Dell is... Ah. <sighs> By the time I arrived, it was already too late. Most of the people had already been transformed into those things. I was lucky even to be able to get you and your friends out of there. Gee! It's not Ding Dong Dell alone. The three kingdoms have all been afflicted by the curse of the mana. Ding Dong Dell, El Mamun, and Hamlin all have been devastated. That's awful! El Mamun too! Oh no! How could this have happened? After all, we and Mom and Lucian did to protect this world. Who the flipper is doing this, Mon, and why? Well, whoever it is, they're stupidly powerful. That Ash wasn't the work of some two-bit villain. Ash, of course. P, P knows something. P, have you seen her? She was in my dream, she said. She said Ash is falling again. And you're sure she met that manna? Well, what else could it be? And she said something else. I have to go back there. What? Go back where? Oh, but that's what she told me. Hmm. She visited you in your dreams. This is no coincidence. Let's go see her. Wait here, your majesty. We'll go find P and we'll ask her what she meant. Will you now? Then you must allow me to accompany you. Oh, you want to come with us? Don't you have subjects to look after, Emperor? This is bigger than the Empire alone. There's even a small chance that it will help save our world. I must do everything I can. You won't get any special treatment from us, you know. That, don't you? Of course. Fine, as your eminence wills it. Let's show the man spewing maniac the power of the great sages. Very well, thank you, brother. All right, let's go to Motorville and find P. I'll leave affairs here in your capable pole hands, Captain Kublai. There are many refugees aboard. I pray that you will use your stout heart to help them regain the courage to fight. Aye, I will. Leave them to me, lad. Oh, huh? why are those two being chummy? And it, though. He pinched his map, didn't he? When did he kiss and make up? Our world is in danger. We must put aside our petty squabbles. And the theft of the map? It was for my own sake. There was. You need something to snap you out of your wretchedness. You and you are an emperor, not a moonstruck goat tired. <laughs> hmm, I'm better now. <laughs> Finally learning to stick up for yourself, are you? Quite a fine teacher. Now to Motorville. I entrust myself to your command, Oliver. Marcus and Miss Familiar have joined your. What? Now switch characters in and out of ba your battle lineup via the Friends and Familiars menu? What? What does he do? Healing touch, drop poison, healing ward, art burden, pulse, frostbite. Wait, I know all these. <laughs> okay. Thunderstorm, I don't know that one. Level 49? Yeah, I'm not using it. Here. You could, have, you could have Gunther. Yeah. What is he like? Oh, I was like, who even likes these animals? Like, like Oh, <laughs> I didn't know we got more people. We just beat- I thought we just beat the game! Okay, head back to Motorville. Oh. Zombifying Ash. Okay, you know what I want to do? Which I forgot to do earlier. I'm gonna save. Okay, phew! Oops, Sir Nash. There's a few things. One, I never read. I just know I've never read Mornstar. What the hell's Mornstar? Mornstar, let the glorious light from your heart burst forth. Mornstar is a legendary magic wand that has been spoken of since ancient times. Mornstar's power, however, does not come from the wand itself. 
comes from its owner's heart. Only wizards who have braved great hardship without surrendering to spite or bitterness are capable of casting the spell, for its glow is that of pure hearted. And... Even Star. Envelop your enemies in an ultimate darkness. Even Star is the most powerful of all dark magic spells, and its rune hook could only ever be drawn by the most powerful of wizards. Telling the energies of the void, it draws its victims into a grotesque world of pain and fear. There are countless tales of wizards losing their lives, attempting to master the spell. A just dessert for covering a weapon of such cruelty. And there's still four spells I haven't learned. I know there's a white page, because I have the book. Oh, I gotta figure out that later. Uh, oh yeah. I did... Uh, my telling stone compendium. Oh. Uh, there's one. Shit, I missed one. <laughs> okay. Well, that sucks. I already, I already missed one. Uh, I missed one uh, creature, so there's only one way to fight the fire fry, and it's in that small... In Perdita. The Perdita to Miasma, that small little path. Uh, it's the only way to get that, and I think I missed a conversation with Old Father Oak. I'm gonna roll back. I missed... Oh shit, right here! <laughs> exactly what? I missed one of these guys to fight... Firefly, so I missed him. My uh... Here goes. So I, I can't get this guy anymore. Or I can't get him anymore. catch him in the wild anymore. Okay. And... I really missed it. I think I could evolve them into it, so... But... My defeated... I can't increase my defeated amount. <laughs> anyway, also, there's one other thing I missed. One other conversation I missed was... One with Old Father Oak. After fighting the other guy. Hey, Old Father Oak! Oh ho, my brave young friend. It is a relief to see you safe and well. But tell me, how did you fare? I fear you have been through much. So, at last, you know the truth. I do, but thanks to everyone else, thanks to my friends, I'm okay. Thanks to your friends and your heart, there's no other like it, Oliver. You are a great wizard, perhaps the greatest. Thank you very much. I'm so glad I met you, old Father Oak. Oh, 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 oh. the feeling is entirely mutual. Oh, that's it? Okay. <laughs> Guess I didn't miss much. Back to the game. Uh, I'm back here. Let's see my progress report. Wizard's Companion Completion 84, Creature 50, hey I got 50%, that's better than I thought. Task 74, Alchemy 17, Hidden Treasures, Coliseum, oh, yeah, I might do that after I beat the game. Let's talk to everyone before I go back. 
Was the Iron Weaver in fair wind, there's no corner of the world that's out of our reach. Did you see that, Oliver? King Tom turned into a monster right in front of us. But monst I thought nightmares were bad, but that was something else. By the time I arrived in Ding Dong Dell, it was already too late for that. I could only apologize. Still, now is not the time to dwell on the past. We must find a way to save the world. Again. Let's talk to you two. Even the pretty Prince of Famlin has toughened up by the looks of it. Didn't think he had it in him. Maybe he'll live up to his forefathers after all. Ha! He's lucky he doesn't have to live up to mine. <laughs> True. The ash that fell upon the three kingdoms was the result of an incomparably powerful spell. And yet it cannot have been Shadar's doing. Another force is at work here. These two. I thought everything was going to be peaceful after defeating Shadar. I keep thinking about the celebration. Smiling and waving at us. Then the ash started falling. You are unhurt. But, of course you are. I should expect no less from a wizard that has overcome the trials. The world remains in a terrible state. However, the cursed ash fell upon my beloved at Alma Mu. I was fortunate to have been on my way to the celebration in Ding Dong Dell at the time. I tried to think what would have become to me if otherwise. Yeah, he'd be crazy. A banana looking creature. Wait, these are in Hammond. This vessel... Warrior. This vessel is truly impressive. Look at it. I think it's been made out of one of the Empire's factories. True. What the hell's this then? Do not concern yourself with the workings of the Weaver and Boy. Leave things like that to the Sky Pirates. Hey, <laughs> yar. Yuck, yeah. I'm worried about the people down below, Oliver. <laughs> I forgot how the kid sounded. Uh, can I see? No, it's just clouds. Alright, time to go back. Take way. Mana, the forbidden spell, the death knell for this fallen world. Indeed, it rings out again as once it did for Nazca. Each time this world ends, one cannot help but recall the name of that forsaken land. The name I recall is Shadar, the one whom we turned executor. Bringing an end to this world was his duty. A task to which he was palpably unequal. Right. But I will not even speak of his duplicity. To think he shared a soul with the Savior. And that he hid this fact from us. It seems that mankind has disappointed your radiance yet again. At the last, the Dark Jinn attempted to save this world. To protect the very creatures that first plunged him into despair. I will not be defied. All who defy our will shall perish. The mortal who shared a soul with Shaddaa still draws breath. Should he too choose to defy our will, his reward shall be death, swift and certain. Oh no. In my dream, P told me something she said. The ash is falling again. You must know something. We need to find her. Fair enough. Well, if you got any ideas, let's go and ferret her out, shall we? Uh, it's in my house. That's my idea. Dora told me to. Oh no. More bad angles. This is where this... Oh, oh god, it's shaking. Oh god. <laughs> Upstairs, isn't it? Ah, the ankles! It's killing me. There she is. Hey, you're here. 
What's wrong, P? Eh, she's there, is she? I still can't see her, Mon. Ask her about this ash stuff, will ya? Oliver! Whaaaaaa! Hey, did something happen? Oliver, Oliver, it fell! What fell, P? It fell again! The ash, it fell, and now everyone's hearts have gone all bad! <laughs> I mean, all over... over in the other world? It's my fault! Huh? No, don't say that, it's not your fault, P. How could it be? Why, it's all my fault! <laughs> Listen to me, P, it's not your fault, we're gonna fix this! P, it was you who saved me, wasn't it? I heard your voice inside me. I've heard it so many times, it was you, wasn't it? Yes, yeah, so I went to see meet you. Thank you, P, I knew it was you. That means there's no way it could be your fault. Oliver! I have to go, Oliver. I have to go back there. To the other world. Oh, huh? you want to go to the other world? Hey, listen to me. It seems like there's some connection between you and the mana. But you're a good girl, okay? You're a nice, kind person. This isn't your fault. I'll prove it to you. I promise. Come with me. Come with us to the other world. Okay, I'll come with you. He is now traveling. Watch. She causes it to go worse. Wait, she's not in our team. Alright. Gateway! Oh wait, I didn't press the book. I wanted to look at that book. <gasps> What's going on, <laughs> man? No! I thought we would be safe here. This place should be beyond the reach of the manor. Can these poor people really be the ship's crew? <laughs> They've been turned into monsters. <sighs> Time for some target practice. You can't. We can't fight these people. What? You'd rather let them tear us to pieces, would you? Leave it to P. <gasps> hey! P, look out! Please get better. Sanctify! Oh shit, she murdered them all. Why oh, me? Oh, Did you see that? Oh, 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 good timing. She cured them just like that. It would have crashed and blew up a... That would have been bad. Flippin' Nora! A dot of a thing like her letting rip with a blooming great spell like that! That's amazing! So this is Oliver's imaginary friend, eh? Young, what's her name? B, <laughs> was it? How come they could talk now? You mean P? That's me! I'm P! But why is it that we can see her all of a sudden? Ah, well, that's easy. Allow Professor Drippy to explain. We can see her because she's in our world, innit? And Ollie Boy could always see her because she's from his world, obviously. Um, wait a minute. Wouldn't that mean that we yeah. should have been able to see her when we went to Motorville? Yeah. Oh, 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 I have to explain every little thing now, do I? I may be a fount of wisdom, but I got my limits, right? Quite. What we do know is that this girl destroyed the crystal. Clearly, she possesses the power to purify mana. The spell she used, I have never seen its like. It was... miraculous. Miraculous? No, it was Sanctify. <laughs> Sank-i-fi. Sanctify? Sanctify. You didn't hear? So P could return those poor people in Ding Dong Dell to their old selves. Indeed she could. In this child, you have the solution to this rather unfortunate problem you face. I'll join our team. Huh? It's you. Oh, that was Shadow. You were the one who sent us back to the past. Yes. You may call me Gallus. I am a member of the council that determines the fate of this world. The Zodiacs. The Zodiacs? The fate of the world? Oh yeah? And what would a busy fellow like you want with the likes of us? I came to thank you. Your power awoke the child. The child? Oh, you mean P? <laughs> I do. Through her, you now possess the power required to Purify this world. Sanctify. Sanctify. 
You mean P's magic can save the whole world? Indeed it can. When you combine your power with hers... It'll do! Ah, young P. At long last, the one you have awaited has come. Yep. <laughs> now we're friends. The time is close at hand. For both you, young P, and for you, Oliver. I wish you well. See you. I guess that's his name. Gallus, the Zodiarchs. I doodle do. I don't understand. It seems some aspects of our world remain hidden even to us. Never mind all that. Did you hear what he said? Sure did. Peace magic could save the world. She could cure all the people who are sick. But the three kingdoms are rife with horrors. We cannot send her into their midst. She's only a child. I'm not a child. I'm a ghost. Hang on a minute, Your Holiness. Have you seen who you're traveling with? It's not exactly or aren't exactly grown-ups. We can protect P, please. Your Majesty, you have to trust us and her. One of us now. She's our friend. Hehe, <laughs> best friends. You wish me to place my faith in her as a friend and ally? It seems I have little choice. <laughs> All right, little Miss Wizard. It looks like we're counting on you. P, let's save the world together! Hooray! Okay, now what? Oh. Even worse than I imagined, the town has been completely overrun by these things. Terrible, who could do these this to so these poor people? And there we were thinking the old broken heart and uh, nightmare or two were the end of the world. We have P on our side. We could bring them back. We could bring them all back. Yes, we can with Sanctify! Indeed, the spell destroyed the Black Crystal, and judging by what followed, it seemed that was the source of the mana. Yeah, Mon, I reckon there's probably another one around by here somewhere, right? Let's see what we can find, shall we? Alright. Where do you reckon the crystal's going to be then, Ollie boy? Looks like we'll have a fight in our hands if we try to head further into town. But Mr. Trippy, we can't fight the people of Digong Dell. I don't know that, Mama. We can't do much. We don't have much choice, is it? We have to, I don't know, knock them out gently or something. Leave no lasting damage, like. Oh, there's this whole breathing peace spell should turn them all back to normal. Yeah, I guess you're right. The crew of the Iron Weavers were okay in the end, huh? We just need to remember that Ting Dong Dell here's got a profitable bucket full of that horrible ash stuff emptied on it. Hang around for too long and we'll end up like these other wretches, P or no P. Yeah, I did thought of I haven't thought of that, then we have to find a black crystal quickly. Alright, and I heard Asheville and Alma Moon and Hamlin as well. I reckon we should probably head straight there once we've finished over by here. What do you reckon, Ollie boy? Great right, Mr. Kirby, we have to save these people. Let's go in here. Is she evil? Did she turn into a cat? Oh, I can travel? <laughs> okay, let's go to the deep dark wood. Oh, old father oak! Oh, ho, here you are again. How very nice to see you. And how goes your journey? Hmm, tell me about it. Oh, my. An evil ash fell onto the town and turned the people into monsters. Upper horrible was your tallness. My mom and Lucy tried to, so hard to protect this world, and now it's in danger all over again. I'll save it this time too, old father oak, you'll see. And you're the only one who can, Oliver. I will do what I can to help you in your fight. Here, this is for you. Yay, such a secret. Thank you very much, old father oak. Right, uh... Sit, travel, vacate... Alright, so I need to fight every version of these villagers. I mean, it doesn't matter, it's already... Uh, yeah, let's fight everyone. Ignatius Tower, we can do this. Legend Doctor, and... Swing. Artist? Oh. 
Get a load of this! What can I say? Right. It's a gift. Yeah, more and more for a football. Kill all the wisp and wispule. Yeah, wispule is the one I need. But uh, since oh, another <laughs> another sword user. Oh, but he uses armor. That's cool. Yeah, I guess you're getting the best armor I got. Only armor user. Alright. Here, I'll give it give it to Swain. Just to level him up. Wait, he can metamorphophose? Electrics to medics. Angelix. Matrix, cause uh, this looks like a healer, and this looks like a damage dealer. Let's turn it. Use it. Nice. Uh, I guess it's an attacker. Yeah, it's an attacker. Flapper mouth, great big goes nothing and what was it? Swing! Now you're for it! Master Potter. Get a load of this! You know. Get a load of this! Presso. Ready? 
Okay. Crosswind. Where the fish sandwiches? One fifty. That's it. These, uh, at least these, I know I can't get it. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Yeah, so five or six. Okay, so there's two more left I need to kill. Swing! 
One more. Must be an animal looking thing, I'm guessing. There's other There's gonna be other zombies in the other luck next time. other towns. But I'm not gonna focus too hard on uh, trying to get them all here. Looks like he's got other ideas. Walking Tom? 
We have to give him a right royal battering. King Tom the 14th. Tom told him something. I forget that was. I was like looking at him. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Step aside. I wish I could rewind while recording. Get a load of this. Cat King's Claw. Get a load of this. Roger. Let me just use arrow. Not. Uh -oh. Try fire. Oh. Oh, let's try even slow. That did a lot of damage. The hell? Warm? Efficient. Time efficient. This takes a while. Yeah, another one. It's better. Alright, monster release. Might as well drink a cappuccino. At least he's weak. I'm like, uh, Shadar destroying us. face oh no because he's standing up you know what that means oh boy make sure you hit him hard before he brings them claws to bear and knock him out of his stride
shit. Come on. So
What can I say? It's a gift. right there. Okay, here goes. Sanctify! Yeah, whatever has one been doing? Your meow just to your back, thank goodness. I'm afraid you've turned into a bit of a monster for a minute there. Okay, a complete monster. Yeah, one remembers nothing. It's okay now, Mr. Cat. Mr. Cat, watch it, you. This here's the king of a kingdom. Such trivialities are no concern to one at present, fairy. One is more worried about one's total loss of memory. Don't worry, you're okay now, your Meow just eat. P saved you, and all the townspeople too. Is that so? Then one must dust oneself off and pull one's kingdom back in order. Tidy, we'll leave things in your capable air paws then, your majesty. Ollie boy, back to the wavern. Okay. The manor was fed by the energy that flowed from the black crystals. They formed the cornerstones of the Forbidden Spell. I'm sure they did, but now they have been destroyed. Surely a mere human could not have carried out such oh, a deed. More stars on the left. Really? Be the one? Your radiance. What do you intend to do about this? Fear not. The manor is but a foretaste of what is yet to come. This trifling victory only delays the inevitable. Indeed. The more mankind struggles, the more surely its fate is sealed. Huh? Yes, they cling to a frail, bleating hope. But it is soon to be torn from them. To see mere mortals raise arms against your radiance. Idiot. <laughs> <laughs> An amusing spectacle. True. <laughs> we look forward to it. Now, Gallus. There he is. Are we to understand that you have had contact with the boy? No. I have. I wished to gauge his power. Gauge his power? And you expect us to believe this? Yeah. Can it be? First Shadar, and now you. You doubt the word of a fellow counselor? <laughs> what nonsense! Enough! Uh, you, your, your radiance. Enough, I say. Yes, radiance. May I, your radiance? That was amazing, P. So your magic really did have power to me purify the mana, huh? Yes, it did. We cleaned up the cash. That's some proper potent magic you got there, young man. You might even be better at wizarding lark than Ollie Boy here. Yeah, <laughs> oh, he's very good too. Here's a flower. Here, a flower. It's to say thank you. Huh? Never seen a flower like that before. Where did you get it, P? It was where the crystal was. The crystal? The black crystal that you destroyed? What kind of flower thrives in a place full of monster making ash? It's my flower. You could have it. Thank you very much, P. We'll take real good care of it. Flower. Oh. Oh god. Oh. Wake up! Father! Why are you sleeping? The Wizard King. Your father. He slipped away most peacefully. But he's there! Why are you crying? No. I'm not crying. <laughs> your Highness, it is time for you to take your father's place. You mean I'll be Queen P? Yes, that is what is expected, your radiance. Really? I wonder if I'll be a good queen. 
And so, the preparations for the succession are all in place. All matters of state have been entrusted to the Council of Twelve. That's right. You don't have to worry your pretty little head about a thing. <laughs> <laughs> Look at her. Princess P hasn't the faintest idea what's going on. Idiot. She is no longer a mere princess. Ah, you are quite right. Please accept my humblest apologies, Queen P. You look simply radiant, Princess P. But we had better start calling you by your true name. The White Queen Cassiopeia. Cassiopeia. But father called me P. You're a big girl now, and after today's ceremony, you'll be known by your big grown-up name. But... I... Your subjects are all toasting your health, Queen Cassiopeia. They're sure that you'll take after the Wizard King and lead our kingdom to a glorious future. But... I'm P. I don't want to be a queen. Queen P? Yes, I'm Queen P. You're flipping what? P, hey, was that... was that really you? Yes, silly, I'm Queen P. You mean to tell us you were in charge of a whole country somewhere? Then what are you doing here? You can't leave your kingdom in the lurch at a time like this. Look who's talking. You left a whole empire in the lurch. Ouch. Um, anyway, if what we saw just now is true, where exactly is this kingdom of yours, P? Yes, we've flown all over the world on Tegri's back, but we've never come across anywhere like that. You met her in your world, did you not, Oliver? Perhaps her kingdom is there? I don't think so. Anyway, the flowers, it's from this world. That is true, which would suggest that she's linked in our world somehow. I'm bored! Damn it, kiddo. The grown-ups are talking. Oh, you're not a child! It have fooled me, anyway. You said the flower was somewhere from where that black crystal was, and it... Yes, it was where the crystal was. And there's other places where the manna's been falling, and it, so... Well, oh, there could be more crystals and more flowers in those other places. Where those flowers may come more clues to peace, true identity, and the location of a kingdom. And it, though, we better keep the flower we've got nice and safe, too. Could be important. Right, P. You mind if we look after your flower for you? You could keep it. Ah, as heartwarming as this is, aren't there still thousands of ash monster people to save? You're right, we have to help them. Flower of youth. That way she's never... Nope. Back to them. We're from another world, blessed with the power of purity. It gives you untold power, still more, a great sage in fact. Yet even you are not capable of casting a spell that girl cast. The power's hers alone. I'm not easily shocked, boy, but when I saw my crew had been turned into monsters by the skies, I had resolved to run them through when your little friend arrived. Lucky she did, eh? Magic of her spared a lot of bloodshed. I could spare a whole lot more down there, in the Three Kingdoms and beyond. Talk to you. Where is it? Nature's tongue. Don't worry, Oliver. You'll be safe on my back. I'll fly you high in the sky, where the ash can't reach us. Now let's go and save the three kingdoms. Oh. No. The Iron River and Fair Wind, there's no corner of the world that's out of our reach. To show you the flowers, Oliver. Thought we were done for when these monsters cornered us in the deck, but we're back to normal. Quickness flash. Please, she's amazing. No more than amazing. No, she's more than amazing. She saved the whole world. That woman, the one that calls herself Queen, she was P. I'm certain of it. But how could she have shown herself to us like that? I simply cannot fathom it. Oliver, is P a queen? I've been talking to her as though we were an ordinary... She was her, an ordinary child. 
I do not think the world could be saved by one so young. Her heart must be exceptionally pure. Yes, Oliver, you are not low in your pure heartedness. Oh, man. This vessel is truly impressive. I think you've made it all. You already said that. Do not consider yourself the workers of a weavern. Boy, leave those things like that to a sky park. Alright. I wanna travel to... You know what? Where is it? Oh, I can't go there anymore! Uh... Perdido? Wait, peace with us. I didn't even notice that. Wispula, Flash Fry, and Trumpy. Still require Trumpy. You said to person musical. Right. Well, yeah, let's buy stuff. I use so much items. All this. Oh, here's a lot of strong coffee. And it's good to use them up because uh, I have too much money. That I lose a lot of money when I die. <laughs> mm. Okay. Let's see if I could go here. It looks like I can't. Oh, what the? I'm glad to meet you once again. So this is the town of Perdita. Though my queen has already departed, I have been reunited with my beloved elf. He does not see me, but I can be with him and watch over him. This is all I ask. Let's talk to Elf. Why don't we just stand near him? Queen Kulan, smiling once again, surrounded by Tansu, it brings it back to me. She represented hope for every man, woman, and child in Xanadu, and now she brings hope to the lives of others. She leaves a sight to warm the heart. Uh, your waifu is over there. She's a ghost, though. And looks like I can't go here. They say marshes are clear of evil miasma that gave their name. Now a beautiful lake stands there. How I long to see- Then why can't I go there? You lie. I don't see a lake here. Looks like miasma to me. But how can I go here again for the purple chests then? Alright, uh. 
so I'm thinking about ending it here, but I want to spend the rest of the episode trying to get a Dinoceros. <laughs> Let's travel to Hamlin. That's the wrong place. I'm at Elma Moon. Please don't do a cutscene. Alright. Dinoceros. from here. That's cool. into that cave to reset all the spawns. The guy doesn't want to talk to me, so... Actually, attack me. Oh, two of them. Please. Come on, you guys! Swing! Now you're for it! Ready? Get a load of this! the second one. Okay, that's... He's gonna use all the items I don't use. Best axe is a giant axe. Best armor is light armor. And... Let's go... Um, these, I guess. Only problem is... Oh, shit. Let's uh, give everyone their stuff. 
15. You get... One accuracy! Okay. <laughs> you're, you're getting max accuracy. Alright, where are you going? here and then next time what the hell there's a bird <laughs> anyway all right i'm gonna end it here and then next time we're gonna go to El moon and save them thanks for watching see ya Bye.